hey guys and welcome back to my channel today i'll be showing you guys how i retwist without any combs pins or hair gels but before i go on further please like this video subscribe to my channel comment and it would be wonderful if you share this video on all your social media platforms like i said earlier in this video i will be using no combs no pins and no gels or wax will be in sight first off i sprayed my hair to hydrate it further because i had just washed my hair but i didn't start to do this immediately so it had dried a bit so i decided to spray it water to hydrate it more and then i generously applied oil on my scalp and the locks eventually i'm using a mix of almond and castor oil almond and castor oil is my favorite oil to use because i love how thick it is and i love how well it seals in moisture so but i'll be using a combination of both i usually interlock my hair but once in a while i retwist in between you know so that i could achieve some kind of um, aesthetics once in a while because once i don't retwist for a while um, there are times when i need that neatness my lock goal right from day one was not to have any sort of build up and that is why i chose interlocking and even when i decided to start retwisting in between i by the time i found out that i could actually achieve the same goal by just using oil and water without the build ups i went for it so i'm just gonna hold my hair in place so that i can go in one after the other to retwist So now I'm going in by grabbing each lock at the roots and making sure that I catch surrounding hair strands while making the parts clean. This is easy to achieve because of the dampness of the hair. So the fact that it's damp makes it softer and easy to grab and then easy to twist. That's what the gel would supposedly do but the oils are doing the same thing. And if you notice I am after twisting at the roots i just palm roll just once and then i form like a loop at the root area just to keep it in place one thing i didn't mention at the beginning of this video is that i'm going to be using a band to hold them in place so that they don't unravel i saw this method on instagram i can't remember the lady the lady who did this and i saw it as a very genius idea and so after i retwist like a group or a set and i feel that the number is enough i then use a band i prefer a rubber band instead of anything made of fabric to hold them together or hold them in place so that it stays that way without unraveling so that i don't use any pins So yes, this is basically it. It's been the best idea ever and I don't need to use any pins. The advantage of this style or this method is that after I am done retwisting my hair, I could actually go out like this. If my hair was really long, I wouldn't need to have more than one band. 
but my hair is not that long so I had to like create this like a pony three ponies so depending on how long your hair is it could be one pony one two you know whatever but whatever is enough for your hair and once you're done if you actually have somewhere to go you don't have to you know the whole pain thing makes it difficult to be functional outside of your home you could just stand up and dress up and go wherever you want it's really a genius idea i can't emphasize how much i love this method i said earlier that i usually interlock my hair but somehow yeah my hair texture and all of it so i had to change my posture and actually my position because somehow my i wasn't comfortable the way i was before so yes this is basically it i don't want to talk too much um remember to subscribe to my channel if you like what you see and yes so please if you want to see how this looks in the end please watch to the end That's it. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Was it helpful? Please comment to ask what else you would like to know or see. Until then, thank you for watching and see you next time.